morning. Welcome to the Belfry and the Brabazon course here. This is gonna be a big day for me. I've always wanted to play here. It's a very iconic course. Obviously home of the British Masters, Ryder Cup, to name a few. Um, it's gonna be a challenge. I'm gonna try and break 80. I'm not gonna to put too, too much pressure on myself to do that, just because whenever I count my score, it normally ends to me playing some stupid shots. So I'm just gonna try and hit greens, hit fairways, and just enjoy the course, to be honest. Um, it's not too bad weather today. It's a little bit soft, but should be good conditions. Hope you enjoy the video and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. All right, lovely introduction there. Brabazon, here we go. Lots of water, 14 holes of water on them. Greens are quick. Lots of hidden bits of water. So ball's going absolutely nowhere. Just hit the range and it's going to be hard to get this somewhere today. So we've just got to try and do our best to pick the right club and hopefully play well. Okay, that's on the PGA on the first tee. All right. I think that might actually be okay. Right, got 159 to the flag. Because it's so cold, I'm going to take an eight. Anywhere on the green or close is fine. Just got to avoid these bunkers next to the green. Go. Be good. Oh no, is that in the bunker? Oh, Try and get this up and down for par. Not really using the facilities much here. Let's try and use the green at least. Use a 56 and pop this out and get it over. Not bad. He did say the greens were quick, so that's probably not the place to be. This is downhill right to left. My bum hole is twinging. Oh, I smashed it. Why am I doing that? I just said it was fast and I've completely misread that. That is so bad. Oh, you, f wow, double bogey on the first. Great start. I'll get those out of the way to start with, I suppose. Okay, a bit of a shorter one now, 321. Not gonna hit driver again just yet because that first tee shot was not good. Just a nice three wood off the right hand trees. The wind should bring it back. Try and get birdie, recover from that double birdie. Oh my God. Please don't tell me it's gonna be one of these days. Okay, well after a horrendous tee shot there, got a long way in so I just need to get on the green and up and down for par now. No chance at a birdie. Get a seven iron up there. Leave a good yardage into the green. Come left. Keep coming, keep coming. That's fine. So I've got about 85 yards. I'm gonna play a three quarter 52. Try and get some spin on it. Short isn't really an option because it's not really on the green. So just try and go straight at it. Leave a nice yardage or uphill putt or even slightly downhill, doesn't matter. Come right. Yeah, so it's all right putt. It's gonna be tough for a par. So left myself a slightly downhill left to right putt. Mate, I barely hit that. That's such a good par, come on. Wow, I thought that was going to stop halfway. Damn. All right, first par five. It's not hugely long, but it's good length. In this weather though, it's long. Bit of right to left wind. Basically the shot hit on the first should be perfect because you don't want to be left in those bunkers. Which is exactly where that's going. Stay right. Nope, that's in the bunker. The green is basically over this Little little edge of the bunker here. Is there any water or anything? Yeah, it's actually. Yeah, that's it. I'm terrible friends, so go for oh, <laughs> oh, okay, I'll go over there then. Yeah, oh crap, I was about to hit that directly over there. Okay, right, well, change of plan. We're going over here because there's lots of water. Just gonna clip a nine iron out 
and leave a shot over the water into the green. Bit thin, but I think that's going to be fine. Is that good? So I think I'm actually going to hit P wedge. Just a three quart swing and try and take it over. That needs to go. Go. Oh, is that in the bank? This is a tough chip. I'm gonna have to land it around here, I think, because it's all downhill. I'm gonna hit 56. It's a tough shot. Anywhere within five feet, I think I'm gonna be happy with. I mean, it's either that or off the green, so. Yes, a par. I'm happy with that on that hole, actually. All right, longer par four now. Try and actually hit this three wood well. Leave myself a birdie. It's gone so high and into those trees. Well, I never hit this like this. I'm pretty much going to punch it where you are, Tom, so you should be all right. You should be all right there, so don't worry. I'm just going to punch it that way. Boring, that's all I can do. Sit at 52, should be the right number. Stay left. Oh, just over. I think this has got a bump and run written all over it. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Kind of play this a little bit out towards the right because it will come back. Need this for a, is this for a B? Yeah, this is for par, so this needs to go in, really. Oh, oh that's gonna be a horrible putt down that hill. Oh, thank God. Happy with the bogey on that hole, considering the tee shot. Okay, gonna give three with a go again on this one. Not the longest par four so it just requires a straight one should this should be short with that right those right hand bunkers because they're 260 and this ball is going nowhere today finally right down the middle wow that's only taken five holes okay 120 left in good tee shot just needs to try and get this one close with a 52 don't mind being short because it'll leave an uphill putt, whereas I think slightly downhill, but not by much. I'll be all over it. Sit. Pin eye on the right. Finally, come on, let's get a birdie. Come on, this will be a huge birdie. Touch too much pace. Two good pars though. Right, lots of water on this one all the way down the left hand side. So I'm actually gonna try and play a cut off the off the water. Because that's the only thing I can really think of doing. If I try to play it out right, I know it's just gonna come left. There's a little bit of wind from right to left. So let's try and just play a nice cut. So that's all I seem to be doing with this club today. I mean it's gone ridiculously high. That's probably gonna be a really long shot in. But it's safe. Yeah, it's plugged in the middle of the fairway. Hopefully I can find that. I'm going to play an easy five. Because I don't think a six is going to get there. Come left. Is that too much? It said 186. Well, this is going to be a miracle shot if I can pull this off. Let's try and play a flop shot. It's down slope. This needs to be good contact. Otherwise it's in the water. Sit, sit, sit. Stop. Okay, it's not horrendous. Could have been a lot closer though. Scared of that bloody bunker, are they? Okay, this is for par. Not an easy putt. Uphill right to left, it's all about pace. Sit. 
Still not an easy putt though. Take a bogey. Okay, saying 150 to the flag. It would be a good nine iron usually, but because of the temperature, I think at eight should be perfect. Oh, hey, that low off the face, that needs to go. Oh, mate, if I'd hit that perfectly. Okay, let's bump and run this one. Uphill right to left. You can be quite firm with it. Don't want to leave this too far short, but also don't want to leave it long, so. Go in, go in. Oh my God. That is gonna be the best bird of the day. Come on. Oh my God. <laughs> I did not think that was gonna go in. What a beauty. Okay. Long par four. Driver off the left to avoid the water. Ecstatic after that last hole. That was a great chip in. Let's try and replicate some good golf. That's a good one. Straight down the middle, right at the geese. Yeah, wind off the left, so that helped. Okay, so 150. A little bit of a wind behind. It's got a little bit warmer now, so I feel like a nine should be good. Don't want to be long, short's fine, leaves an uphill putt. Start out a little bit left. You can see the wind blowing the flag from left to right. Ah, oh, that's gone right. I can't, that's gonna be in the bunker, isn't it? Oh, just avoided the bunker. That's all right. So I think with this one, I'm gonna play bumper run again with an eight. Slightly uphill right to left. Just try and get it there. Pretty much aim where the camera is and hope that it brings itself back round. Ah, oh, died on the front. Damn it. Still an uphill putt, so that's doable for par. I smashed that. Mate, I thought that was uphill. I didn't take any pace off it. Oh my God. Oh my God. My heart rate. Right, long half four to finish now. Water on the right. I don't really think he's in play, but it's that bunker in the middle I've got to worry about. So I kind of draw into the wind, which goes left to right. Start of that bunker and hope the wind brings it back over. Oh, get over that car. That's either over or in it. Yeah, definitely. I don't mind being short. I don't want to be anywhere near that water. So I've got a bit of a downhill lie so that we'll turn it into a bit of more of a 50 degree than a 52. So 122 to the flag. Aiming out way left, I don't want anything to do with the right hand side here, because loads of water. Keep going, keep going. Oh, that hit that bit thin. That is okay. Avoided the bunker, that's the main thing. So yeah, a bit short, a bit of a fluffy lie, so there's a little bit of a bowl of a green as well around there, so it's quite a good pin position. Gives you plenty of security so open the fuck club face a little bit half swing get it close mate what the f is that man spin come back down don't stay there keep coming go in the hole I'll take that. I will take that. Bogey. Don't mind that. Time for the iconic 10th. There's a good front nine. We're wind behind and downhill, so there should be a good five iron. If I can get it there. Ah, oh, why has that gone right? Mate, what the f is going on with me? Okay, that's on the bank. That's playable. Well, I bet no one's ever been up here before. This is hard. 
Gonna have to land this right on the front of the green because I cannot go long here. The 56. If anything, even land it on this bank. Kick down there. Sit, 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 sit. Stop. Mate. Oh my God, where was that? That. Right, let's try that again. So this would be for, for par. That's what I should have done. Why have I done that off the bank? Donkey. Oh, this is a nerve wracking putt. Based off my last shot, or the one that went in the water, this is gonna have to be delicate. Stop. Okay. Oh, you. Mate, these greens are killing me. Six. Forget about that one. Okay, another long one. Quite a lot of bunkers, but just need to keep this straight. That's gonna be in the bunker, I think. Oh, just short of it. I was lucky. Okay, so I've got 180 out of the rough. Should I try and, actually no, five on, it's into wind. We'll get there eventually. Our oh, wind, bring it round. Well, oh, it's on the far right hand side of the butt of the green. I'm gonna play this up to the right. Try and just take it a couple of feet outside the, the pin. Oh, well, if you hit the ground, then obviously that's not going to help, is it, you donut? Go. Oh, you. Mate. Okay, a bit of a beast of a par three now. Pins are right at the back. It's touch and goes 215 to the flag. Obviously, it's a little bit colder, so I just don't know if four iron's going to be enough. Normally I'd have a five wood, which would be perfect. Split into wind as well. So just a, a choke down. Not that, hopefully. Easy three wood. I think that's gonna be right on that side. There is a little bit of a slope. Yeah, okay, that's fine. I've just got to go over a stream. Lots of thick grass. Try and keep this right, because it slopes down to the right. Left, sorry. Try and pop it out. This grass. Should, excuse me, do you mind? I'm trying to play golf here. Right, this has got chipping written all over it. For par. Go in. Oh. Bogey will do. Just a quick sit rep on the course. I mean, overall condition of the green is excellent. Really fast, really fun. The rest of the course is just like a standard course you pay 40 quid for. Really not like 75 quid's worth, especially at the Braverson. That's how much I pay, by the way. It's a winter midweek green fee. But hey, you're playing the Braverson. It's an iconic course, so still enjoying it. Don't think we're gonna break 80, but still having fun. All right, long par five now, 5.30. Needs to try and do something on these holes because so far, not really been doing much this uh, back nine. Is this par four? Oh, I read it as 5.30. That looks way longer than 3.50. Okay, still though, still just gonna hit three, uh, three wood. It's into wind, so. That was right off the toe. Please come left more and get over those trees. I think it's over the right hand tree, so that's... Okay, so this is a bit touch and go. If I can get this under this tree, I'd play a normal nine, an easy nine maybe, with the wind. Hopefully this gets under 137 yards. Oh, be good. Be good. No! Oh, it's in the bunker. 
Never mind, it was online. Well, a bit disappointing with that. It was the right length, uh, right length, right line. Just caught it a little bit thin. Never mind, tough shot now. This is gonna have to be a delicate, delicate chip out. It's a bit of green to work with, so should be doable. Quite firm sand. Take a bit of sand and softly get it up there. Ah, oh, double hit it. Hit the ground first. That's not the end of the world, but that was f***ing awful. Sit. Not enough break, but there's a good length. Take a bogey. Not ideal. Ah, oh, love this sun. Nice par three now, 166 to the flag. Quite a lot of wind off the left. So I'm gonna try and play a nice tight draw with a seven. The wind will hold it up and just, just get it on the green. Just leave myself a birdie putt and try and make another birdie. Be the right number. How is that short? Not the worst, but just need to hit it a bit firmer. Kind of hit it a little bit fat. Still good amounts of green to work with, just don't want to go over here. Slightly fluffier sand to work with. Let's try and get this out. Oh, you absolute donkey, sit. It's really firm sand. Like, there's no giving that. I don't know whether or not it's just the bounce of my club, but I think this one is moving dead straight, slightly downhill. It's about pace again. I think that just came out right on me from the rough. Bogey again. All right, gorgeous par five now, 480 yards. Quite a lot of wind left to right, so I'm gonna try and play a nice draw. I'm probably gonna lose this mid-air, so I need to try and keep an eye on this. Aim at those left-hand bunkers. A little bit of a draw, let the wind bring it round. Come on, wind. All right, hit some trees. So I've just found the rough on the left-hand side here. No point going for this. Just kind of lay this up in front of that front bunker and leave a wedge on. Get down there. Oh, kind of sat down in some rough. That's potentially an issue. All right, 176. Quite a lot of wind behind. I think I'm going to play an eight. Because it's out of, the, out of the rough. It's going to come out hot. Slight downhill lie. So I went into water there just to let you know. Sorry, I've taken a drop here. So this is my uh, fourth shot. Get up there. I think it's good. Got a thumbs up. I'm gonna play bump and run here. Uphill, slightly right to left. There's a little bit of backstop as well, so I'd actually mind being a bit long. If it roll back and come back down, that'd be great. Just can't leave this short. Come back down. Don't you dare stop there. Now yeah, it's gonna be a tricky putt down that hill. I thought that broke to the right, uh, left, sorry. Oh, fuck you. Another, basically the same shot as the last hole, hopefully. Absolutely awful hole, that one. So we'll forget about that. Another hard draw. Come on, wind, keep that. Oh, I almost killed a duck, I think. It's literally where those ducks are. Right, bit of an interesting approach shot here. Now, 158, I'm gonna play an eight on. Should be the right club. Wind left to right, aiming way far out right because it's gonna come right and the wind will take it. 
Biscuits on, this is gonna be a miraculous shot. Oh no, it hit the tree, I hit that thin. Okay, I short the bunker. That's all I care about. Oh, you donkey. Come down, come down. Keep coming. It's good length. Excuse me, a downhill putt. Go in. Oh. Double bogey. All right, last couple of holes. The 18th looks like a fantastic hole and there's a nice bit of sun as well. So this one just requires a nice cut off the bunker there or even in between that and the other ones and just bring it around the corner. So a cut for me shouldn't be a problem today. Yeah, the wind should hold that up nicely. Oh, it might be in that bunker though, but that's still fine. All right, 290 to the flag, zero point going for this. So just a seven iron to get up to the fairway up there and leave a wedge on. Oh, oh no, get over that. Don't be in that ditch. Oh my God, just before, that was a horrendous strike. Okay, 144, gonna hit eight iron. I don't want to be short. Just need to get this there. Just see the flag over the top of the bunk, hopefully. So right. Wow, that's long. Not what I was, not as downhill as I thought. I was scared of that. Now this is even worse. Stop. Why you do this? Do you want out? Last hole, wind from left to right. Really tough, long par four. Just need to play, play, play a draw into this wind. I'm calling it, he's not responding. I think that's just past him. But 160 odd. I'm gonna play seven, it's into wind. Oh, I don't know if seven is enough actually. Let's play an easy six. Oh, catch the slope. Ah, oh, bottom tier, perfect. Come on. This for a birdie on the 18th. I don't believe it. Sit. Wow. Oh, mate. This is awful golf here. Bergie to finish. What a round. Thanks for watching.